at that high pressure that continues to build today, keeping those temperatures well above average. Well, tomorrow those temperatures are going to cool back down to seasonal as a low pressure system dips down, but it's also going to bring with it some rain chances. So we could see light showers across the county early tomorrow morning with some showers lingering in our mountain communities by mid morning. However, conditions look like they will clear up by the afternoon, but we're not looking at a lot of rain with this system, possibly a couple hundredths of an inch here in Bakersfield as well as Lake Isabella closer to 14 hundredths of an inch into Hatchby a little bit more at the grapevine closer to three quarters of an inch and we're looking at gusty winds with this system as well. So at 7 a.m. We're looking at potentially 17 mile per hour gusts in Bakersfield 24 in Fraser Park 31 into Hatchby 26 up in Lake Isabella looks like they'll stay strong through those afternoon hours picking up even more as well as in the evening and overnight hours Wednesday looks like it'll have breezy and gusty winds as well. But for now, dry conditions and those low 80s here in the valley dipping down to the 50s overnight. Tomorrow we cool back down to those low 70s. Seasonal temperatures continue through your midweek and we cool down even more on Friday with some more rain chances. However, conditions warm up and we clear up just in time for the weekend. In the Kern River Valley, high of 76 dipping down to the 50s overnight. We dip back down to those mid 60s and they stick around for your midweek. Tehachapi 72 as that high today and dipping down to those upper 40s overnight. Those mid 50s in Tehachapi on Tuesday and Wednesday as well. And those rain chances tomorrow in breezy conditions. 74 is that high in Fraser Park, dipping down to the low 40s overnight. We're looking at those 50s returning ahead of more rain chances on Friday.